Hi there, I'm Vidur and I'm a security engineer at Astra. Today, we're going to learn about WordPress users and their roles. Understanding roles and properly assigning them to users is essential in the process of segregation of duties. So these are the WordPress roles. Super admins have access to the site network administration features and all other features across all sites. Administrators have access to all the administration features within a single site. Editors can publish and manage posts, including the posts of other users. Authors can publish and manage their own posts. Contributors can write and manage their own posts, but cannot publish them. And lastly, subscribers can only manage their own profiles. Only an administrator can assign roles to other users. If you are the admin of your WordPress site, you can assign a new role to any user by going into the Users section and selecting a role. But if you want to assign a custom role to users, then you can easily do so by using a plugin. We'll use the User Role Editor plugin, but you can use one of a variety of plugins. After installing this plugin, you can configure its settings according to your requirements. You'll see a new option listed as Other Roles when you add a new user, where you can assign extra roles for this particular user. You can even configure it to add secondary roles to the primary roles, which the new users will be assigned by default. You can also make changes to the capabilities of the already existing roles like the subscriber or add a new custom role with the capabilities that you want to assign to that role. The custom roles you create will show up alongside other roles when you add or edit users. One possible use case is to restrict administrators from being able to edit plugins and users. And if you want to make changes to the capabilities of a particular user, you can also do that easily using this plugin. I hope you like this lesson and I'll see you in the next lesson.